The very first corn harvest cab cam of 2015 from the Farm Science Review in Madison County. I'm Ty Higgins for the Ohio AgNet, riding along Farm Science Review Manager Nate Doritas. And Nate, you mentioned when I hopped in the cab that it feels like wheat harvest being that it's 90 plus out here. But uh, your first day and first field shelling corn, how are things looking so far? Uh, it, it is a hot one out there today and uh, we're glad to be back in the field, get harvest started here. Pretty optimistic, I think, on corn in general. So we've got some good yield potential out there. Glad to get started. We're going to start picking off a few fields here that are uh, drying down. Right now, we've got moisture is right around 20% on our 100-day corn for the demos. And yield average for this field is 174. We've seen a couple of spots uh, about 215, 220. And uh, pretty typical for this field, but you're hoping for better next year after you get some tile in here. That's right. This field we're in now is uh, scheduled for the tile demonstration during the review. Uh, you can come out Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday and watch the Ohio land improvement contractors put tile in here. And uh, this field should, should be, do a little better for us. We just need to get rid of some of the extra water. September 22nd, 23rd, and 24th, the dates for this year's Farm Science Review. And one of the things I know a lot of guys are going to be interested in is something called Farm of the Future. And explain to me what that is and exactly uh, what guys are going to be looking for when they head out to see those plots. Yeah, so as you come across the field demonstrations from the exhibit area, uh, there'll be a shuttle bus that'll stop uh, right across from the Gwen Conservation Area. And there'll be some signage and possibly some equipment sitting there where we have the Farm of the Future field. And we did some interesting things there. Uh, the thing you'll notice right away is there's uh, 20 foot of corn and 20 foot of beans all across that field. We did that with the same planter in one pass. And uh, the, the corn varies by population uh, in the row. So we're trying to tease out, tease out a little extra yield in those uh, edge rows where they're not competing with uh, anything other than the soybeans. So guys, guys will be able to walk right out to the field and uh, take a look at that. Nate Doritas, the manager here at Farm Science Review. Again, it's just a couple of weeks away, September 22nd, 23rd, and 24th. Taking off our first field of corn here in London at the Molly Karen Ag Center. For the Ohio AgNet, I'm Ty Higgins. We'll see you down the road.